Hello guys and welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about the most recent updates about the FE exam. Now, if you are currently studying for your FE exam, go ahead and comment below FE exam. And now let's dive in. Oh yeah, Update number one, NCS website. Have you noticed something different when you recently visited the NCS website? Well, they have given it a fresh makeover. Now, while the design and the layout have been revamped, many aspects remain in change, such as accommodations, the specifications, and the calculator policy. The new design just feels more streamlined and organized. Update number two, the reference manual. Back in July 2020, the NCS has made some major changes to both the specifications and the reference handbook, marking the launch of the reference handbook 10.0. Now, recently, they have launched a newer version, the Reference Handbook 10.3, and they haven't made any change, major changes. But if you guys are interested and you want to learn more about these changes, you can head over their errata page. And there you'll find a detailed PDF listing all the updates made in this latest version of the reference manual. Update number three, no hard copy of the reference manual. So once you've signed up or logged in into your NCS account, you can download the reference manual for free. However, there's been a change. So the NCS no longer offers the hard copy of the reference manual. So before they used to also sell the hard copy of the reference manual, but now that's not an option. So you can only get it as a PDF. Now, personally, I always recommend that you guys use the reference handbook as a PDF because it just helps you prepare mentally for the exam environment. But I also get it if you also want to have a hard copy of the book because it just makes it easier. You can skim through the equations and just look at the content, right? So if you do want the hard copy, you can check Amazon. Just make sure that you, got, you are getting the most recent version. Now, I also recommend that you guys check out this video here where I talk about how to quickly go through the reference handbook, which is going to save you so much time during your exam. Update number four, the practice exams. Remember when the NCS only offered the hard copy of the practice exams and it was expensive. Like I remember when I first got mine, I paid around $70 because of the shipping costs. But here's the good news. The NCS now offers a digital version of their practice exams for only $30 and you can get access to it right away. Now, beyond the cost saving, the digital practice exam can help you be better prepared for the actual test. So you can have it on your screen. You can also pull up the reference handbook. Just make sure that you guys use control shift F because that's the search box that you're going to have on your FE exam. And you also get a feel for what the real exam setup is like, right? And that's exactly what you want to do. You want to recreate the exam environment as closely as possible so that you are mentally prepared for this test, right? Because it's all mental preparation. And just remember to grab your paper, your pen, your calculator, and your timer, and you're ready to go. Update number five, conceptual questions. Now, in terms of the exam itself, it hasn't really changed. The exam still covers the same subjects and you can check the specifications on their website. And also the type of questions you get hasn't changed either. So you still encounter a mix of multiple choice, fill in the blank, drag and drop and point and click. Now, one thing I recommend that you guys do when you are studying for your FE exam is don't just focus on the practical questions. It's crucial to also grasp the underlying concepts because you will encounter number of conceptual questions on your exam. Now, if you're not sure on how to tackle these questions or how to study for them, make sure to check out this video here where I share five tips on how to prepare for these type of questions. If you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and also make sure that you guys hit the bell because on the next video, we're going to post a mechanics of materials problem and you guys don't want to miss it. And also, if you are looking for some good study resources that will help you pass your FE exam faster, make sure to check out our courses where we cover everything that you need to pass your FE exam. And also, if you decide to get our bundle course, you get a conceptual practice exam with it. And if you want to learn more about the FE exam itself, make sure that you guys check out this playlist here where our students share their FE experience with us. Now, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great productive week and I will see you guys on the next video. A la prochaine. Oh yeah,